Okay, so we've had the warm up matches. So now we're just going to go in and see if we can practice some stuff. Do a bit of long play thinking. And we're off. Okay, so just pushing through the center. Just developing the night, as you know we're gonna do. And let's attack the king. Let's set the stall up. And let's capture Castle. Yeah. So tempting every time when if they do do that move to just push this pawn here. It really is, but it's I'm on a loser because he's got like two pieces on there. It's so tempting. Tempting to push that as well. Tempting to go here. Open up the dark square bishop. I think I'm gonna bring the knight out. I think there is a problem with bring the knight out here, but I'm going to just give it a try. So it tends to kind of block this in a little bit. So we could still go for this now. Let's see. Try to give them something to think about while they're doing this slow fianchetto. Trying to get through to the rook here. So we're going to be mindful. We're always saying once they go for the fianchetto, got to watch that lazy diagonal that it wins. So we could take with the knight or we could develop our queen, but he could always just challenge and then we have to move the queen out of the way. Could come across here, but then the queen's just working by itself, isn't it? Other concern I've got is if I bring the knight here, it does go here and then it's got like an extra ray through to two or, two or three pieces there. But if we do do that with the queen, he still has the extra ray through and it's extra ray through to the queen. But if he does do that, then we can push the pawn up. But he does have two pieces. One, knight takes. Maybe the knight doesn't take and then he comes here and then he's got like three on one and my queen's trapped. Let's run through that one. Yep, yeah, comes there. Bishop comes here. Push the pawn onto the knight. Knight doesn't have to do anything, he could actually, because he doesn't have to take, or this pawn doesn't have to take, could just move the knight down, because then the bishop is attacking the pawn, this pawn is attacking the pawn, and the knight is knight's attacking, so the pawn can't take the pawn, because the queen, bishop will take the queen, but if that knight's gone there, then we could move here, and we're attacking this pawn, but that means this pawn can take this pawn for free. We take that pawn, but then his rook comes and attacks here. This bishop's protecting, we can take here. Oh, it could get a bit messy, couldn't it? Let's give it a try. Yeah, so he's gone straight there. So we're going to go here. We're expecting the knight to jump down here or to here somewhere and then we said we're going to go here and start working the queen to death <coughs> oh they've not done that so they're delaying that okay so if we did take we are attacking this square but then this knight is looking to move isn't it this is me overthinking and this is the thing that I do when I'm playing over the board chess um, like I said this is one of my major weaknesses I overestimate the skills of the opponent based on everything that we've watched in games. You were doing calculation, bam, 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 they could do X, Y, and Z, and then it gets fluffed. So I'm trying to over underestimate in this one. So at this point, we can take, I'm just mindful if this knight can move somewhere and then it's going to be on our queen. So we take. Hmm. Let's go again. We take, then this knight moves here. He's got three pieces on there. He's on my knight as well. Yeah, we don't win out, do we? We take, his knight moves.
Yeah, we're going to be down a minor piece if that happens. Uh, I don't like that picture anymore now. <laughs> um, okay, yeah, we don't win out. Knight goes here. Knight takes. Because uh, I was thinking taking here, but he's got his king there as well. So his queen takes, then the knight, yeah. Ooh. Calculation went wrong there. So we take, so we get the pawn back, but then he takes our knight. Then that's okay. But he's going to get arty because he moved there quick in his last move. And he's going to go here. But if he goes there, our queen... Queen can just take the knight, can't it? Let's take this pawn. Oof, overthinking. I still think it's not that great, but... So he's moved across. Damn it! Oh! <laughs> oh! He had this sewn up, didn't he? Oh, don't, don't. Could bring the bishop here. Because it's a two on one, isn't it? But then his pawn's probably just gonna drop. Oh, we're gonna be down a piece, dudes. Ooh, very nice, very nice. So if we're gonna be down that knight, we can't even go there because he's gonna be actually on our queen. And even if we went here like this, his knight takes, we take his knight, he still gets the knight anyway. Oh my days, I fell right into that, didn't I? Wow. Oh dear me, I don't even know how to get out of it. I'm going to have to just, uh, I don't have a check on his king, do I? Just take and then take and then at least at least nothing uh, hold on a minute hold on a minute oh no yeah if I take takes 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 I would have I'm gonna be down aren't I so we go and tap the knight queen takes we take the queen his king takes so that looks like an even exchange, doesn't it? Because we're going to have a knight, a bishop, bishop. I thought we were going to be down. Hmm. Let, let's have a look at it once it's been done. Was I panicking for nothing there? It's even Stevens. Damn, I thought I was going to be down. His king can't castle now either. My knight. Oh, and he's resigned. <laughs> You're joking me. You're joking. I'm sorry, camera. You're joking. Oh my god, I, I didn't. I'm going to have to look at the analysis on that one because <laughs> that was so bad. Well, it felt bad. I'd overestimated massively. Oh, <laughs> I put a bit of a smile on my face. Oh dear me. Right, let's have a look at this bad play here. I really thought I was going to be pieces down. Okay, let's. Uh, this evaluation bar is really slow. Is it working? Okay, so we push through onto the pawn, feeling comfortable. And we set the plan to attack the knight thinking we're winning and then we circumvented our own brain by saying we're not winning now because the position isn't what we expect it to be it's plus point not six not point two so it's a plus of sorts so we didn't didn't look like we needed to panic or well, then it's dropped to minus point one three 
then then yeah then the night went across and that's when we had heart attack thinking we're losing but it's gone up to plus 0.62 that is surreal because then we did look at it and we felt oh we might actually be equal I genuinely thought we were losing this night somehow from that exchange and then capturing gives us a plus 0.2 that's not much at all and then capturing gives us plus 0.36 and then the king capturing is plus 0.51 so we were slowly creeping up but that position with the knight I genuinely thought that we were losing out on tempo so we must have inadvertently done the correct calculation although once we'd done the move we kind of thought oh they do have a bit of a fork situation going on but it seemed to work out okay phew dear me that was uh, stressful going to go on to the next one okay so we've had the warm up matches that was our attempt at a proper match <laughs> um, so we'll go in for another one So we'll see what this one's got in store. I think I knocked the camera too much there. Oh, we're on. Ooh, don't tell me off. What does he like to do? Take the palm. Yes, so he's a grabber. Let's attack. He's thinking of something arty, isn't he? Gonna do a dance. he would have made his move already the simple version is capturing the knight but no I'm going to go and dance and oh ok nice and simple let's oops excuse me let's take with the bishop it's looking like he thinks he's got it sewn up I think this knight's jumping here isn't it let's go here castle getting the basics sorted what was that let's just grab this and shall we entertain an exchange He's wanting to do something silly but kind of arty. I can, I've got a feeling in my water. Yeah, so he's out. Let's take this. It feels like an arty talk sort of play. I don't think he expected us to take the queen. We're not really into arty, so. Your art fell on deaf ears. Let's, shall we? See, I'm quite liking this position. I'm going to have to go here. Now he's got to shoot here because he wants this pawn. Yep, let's go here. This pawn's got to shoo this bishop away. It doesn't like the bishop being there. So now they've slowed down. The craziness has gone. 
it's now looking for those positions obviously the rooks want to be kind of trying to own these files if they can so if he's going to waste his time doing um, let's just see what the knight wants to do he might still push down onto the bishop anyway um, before I go rushing in there I mean I could just take he takes takes I don't think so shall we oh if I move if I move then it does get the pawn doesn't it I might as well satisfy the fact that I'm going to double the pawns take a bit of a rook off the board triple up these pawns here so I'm losing quite a few pawns here stealthily come here see if we can get a back ranker stealth What's the scores on the door? So he's going for a blocker. Do you hear me? I don't think that would be advisable, would it? Let's, uh, see what you're doing. I thought they were going to be plus some things. Not yet. Interesting times. I think we're a little bit jammed in really there's nothing definite for us at all so he has to do that doesn't he Obviously, I think the best move probably for them, I'm just thinking for them, is going here because I'm looking to go here. Take the bishop off the board if I can. His bishop's looking to come here to attack our rook. We can slide up here. He's really looking. Ah, oh, they can hear me. I need to stop talking. Man. swing here attacking the bishop bishop takes bishop takes it's gonna have to move the bishop out of the way I'm going to do that just take it off the board hold on stop a minute I might not do that I might take this one uh, so the bishop's attacking this palm yeah we could attack the bishop oh but then it's gonna come here I moved a bit too fast So it's a take fest and do we win out really? Not really because we're down a piece because we need to take this piece back. So their pawn structure is a lot better than ours. But it's still even. Rick's coming into the game, supporting. Could go and attack the rook. He wants to come here. Attacking the pawn. And then he's attacking the bishop. So that's not going to work. 
could come here attacking the rook okay and he comes here let me go here but then his bishop takes takes support in the pawn interesting times or does the bishop just take anyway I'm actually just bringing the although this pawn is kind of gone isn't it so they're going to be plus one we were disheveled anyway we do have a bit of rook action here maybe potentially getting here I don't think that's going to work but it depends on what the opponent does next I think they're probably going to take take and then they're going to be up oh shah it's not done that so he's isolating his center pawn because if we take there and then if we take the bishop then this pawn comes into the center as well I'm going to take Uh, oh, ah, do you know what? His pawn's going to push onto my bishop and he's going to come past. Oh, didn't even see it that way. Damn. Well, this is a bit of a delicate operation, isn't it? My pieces are not in the best shape at all this is one of those games where you go how did I end up in this position <laughs> what happened here and then you pick the board up and you you see you're never playing chess again I don't understand what happened in this game His power base is these pawns attacking here. We can dislodge the bishop a little bit, but we need to get the king activated coming up towards here. But we've got a problem on this side as well, which is it's a bit tense. Could offer a draw. Let's see if he accepts a draw. Did I click it? Well, it's grayed out. They're probably thinking, no, I'm winning this, I'm winning. But come on, let me just get another game on. I don't know how we ended up in this position. Disconnected. What do you mean disconnected? Don't disconnect, dude. Just take the draw. <laughs> oh, it's one minute left. I don't think they're going to leave the game when they've come this far. I would say Black is um, potentially winning. But um, I wouldn't count myself out because we do like messing about with the kings and stuff and getting a bit of a blockage and stuff but I think if he plays these pawns right, gets his king up 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 then we're a bit stuck doesn't look like they're coming back unless of course they're fashioning the magical tool shining it up, ready to come back on Oh dear, I played quite a, quite a few games today, I played a few Blitz games yesterday, that was really interesting, considering I said I wasn't playing until after the over the board tournament, but hey, I like playing chess, you can't shoot me down for playing chess. It's got to 20 seconds, I think they're either going to leave it to the last dying seconds and maybe accept the draw, or like I said they've shined up their shiny new tool and all the magic is going to kick into place doesn't look like they're doing it is it well that is a shame actually 